Hello, this is the intro to Spanish. It's recommended for ages 11 and up. My name is Aiden Ilias. Lesson summary. During this presentation, students will learn the cultural background of Spanish and basic concepts of the Spanish language. Skills acquired during this presentation are the understanding of the importance of the Spanish language, and you will learn basic phrases and greetings. Why should you learn Spanish? There are five big reasons that you should learn Spanish. Number one, it is so common. It's actually one of the most common languages in the whole world, and it amounts to over 500 million speakers. Number two, it's getting even more popular. In terms of popularity, Spanish shows no signs of slowing down with the total number of speakers increasing steadily over the past decade. Number three, learning Spanish will help you greatly in the future. If you are planning to enroll in college, applications value having a second language, especially one as, as popularly spoken as Spanish. The same also applies to job applications. Since Spanish is so common, it's extremely valuable to have that as a skill on your application. Number four, traveling experiences will be even better. Since Spanish is the national language for so many countries worldwide, understanding the language can help enhance your experiences as you travel to those countries. Number five, Spanish is also Latin-based, just like English, which makes it a lot easier to pick up a language like Spanish or French. Many of the words in Spanish have the same or similar word bases to English words, making it easier for you to understand and comprehend why they say what they say. An interesting quote by Franz Fanon, a psychiatrist, that I'd like you to keep in mind is to speak a language is to take on a world, a culture. By learning Spanish, you're experiencing a culture that's known by 500 million people around the world. Once again, over 572 million people speak Spanish worldwide. It's one of the most fastest growing languages, and it's spoken by all of the flags that are represented on this picture. The following is Spanish on a map. Areas with the darkest blue have the most Spanish speakers. Blue areas are the primary Spanish speaking areas, though there are Spanish speakers everywhere. Here are 10 important phrases to know. Good morning is buenos dias. Good afternoon is buenos tardes. Good night is buenos noches. What is your name translates to como te llamas. One note to make is that it actually directly translates to how do you call yourself but we take, we take it as, what is your name? Another note is that a double L makes a Y sound or a Y sound. An example is that we may read L-L-A-M-A-S as llamas, but it actually makes llamas. My name is Eden, translates to me llamo Eden. A note to make is that you replace the underlined part with your name. How are you translates to como estas. A note here is accents point out where you emphasize the word, pronunciation. So an O means there is an emphasized sound on the O. Instead of como, it's como. Well, how about you? Translates to bien, y tú? The Y makes an E sound rather than a Y. Can you repeat that more slowly? Translates to puede repetir más despacio?
The word please translates to por favor. No problem means de nada. I'm sorry translates to lo siento. Lastly, goodbye translates to adios. Now it's your turn. After taking some time to review those 10 words, translate these as I say them. Good morning. What is your name? My name is... How are you? Well, how about you? Can you repeat that more slowly? Please. No problem. I'm sorry. Goodbye. How did you do? If it wasn't so good, go back and review the 10 terms. If not, good job. Here's the appendix. Check out these resources to learn more. The first link goes to a YouTube video that teaches you top 25 must-know Spanish phrases. The next link is Duolingo, a free language learning website. It's also an app that's downloadable on any phone. The next link is Conjugamos. It teaches you how to conjugate Spanish terms and has fun games to help you learn. Students learn for free. Here's another interesting quote. If culture was a house, then language was the key to the front door to all the rooms inside. Here's some information about me. Hola, my name is Eden Ilias. I'm a senior from Fairfax, Virginia. I love art, music, dancing, and watching movies. I'm about to enter my fifth year of learning Spanish or Espanol. I'm so excited to become a better Spanish speaker because it's one of the most commonly spoken languages. This will be helpful since I want to enter the medical field and I'll be able to talk to Latin patients. Do you have any questions? For more information, go to internsforgood.org.